Hello everybody, welcome to the Rebel Roundup, match day three. Once again, I am completely obsessed with the World Cup, having to do that all the time, so just a straight upload of my match, then a quick look at the other matches around the league is all we have time for today. So enjoy my fantastic, amazing match versus Puppy's Orcs. And he does get a blitz, brilliant. Hello everybody, welcome to my match day three Rebel um, game and of course my opponent gets a blitz um, I my tokens my token blitz defense was these two not being on the LOS um, and yeah I've been shot on there haven't I I won the toss just to receive to try and you know remove a bunch of players with claw mighty blow and instead probably gonna get guard locked a guy pommed and achieve absolutely fuck all so there you go I shouldn't have predicted a draw I should have predicted a loss for myself because this is going to be horrible. Um, I mean, it is Orcs versus Chaos. I've got some Claw Pom. If the Claw Pom fires, it's very good for me. Um, if it doesn't, it's very, very, very bad because he's if got so much strength. Positive, then, uh, he's got, got so much strength and so much guard. Like baby and I've got so little of anything. Them, eh? It's just, it's absolutely, it's absolutely pathetic, really. What a, what a hard matchup this is. And my player's going to get killed. And. I'm going to probably just go and cry in the corner. There you go. Positive. Yeah, at least this bliss didn't happen in the World Cup yet. Yeah, it doesn't... You know, the, the, the game doesn't mean a whole lot. I don't, I'm not going to lose any sleep if I lose this game, but still, I still hate fucking losing. Get fucked, you little cunt! <laughs> Fuck off! <laughs> Thanks for that, Johnny. Are you going to spam that? Am I going to have to put a... And we're going to have to put a, a, a prohibitive cost on that sound effect. But yes, I have absolutely got fucked um, in this game. This blitz is an absolute killer. Instead of starting the match with two claw pom hits and a claw mighty blow, I'm starting getting pommed. And it's just fucking... It's just stupid. <laughs> Shawnee flashlights. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> I'm just gonna have to open with like one dice blocks or something. Obviously I want a claw palm. Um one dice, could one dice him, looking for a push, then two dice claw palm. Then he can one dice him. Oh, he could one dice him, then he could claw palm him. And then I could claw palm him. Or he could blitz there. Then he could 2D him. Then he can't blitz because he's already blitzed. So it's just, it's just shit, isn't it, really? He's got jump up, so I don't really want to leave anyone next to him. Blitzing him, pomming, then he blocks him. No, then he one dices him. No, he one dices first. Oh, I just can't do anything because he's got too much guard. He could one dice first. Then he could. Then he could one dice him. So he could push him, he could push him, then he can 2D him. This is, this is just so fucked. It's so completely fucked. No, it's uphill, isn't it? Fuck me. One dice then. Good. Does nothing. <sighs> he could blitz him. He can block him. He could block him. No, he's got the, he's got the blitz, hasn't he?
<laughs> oh, this is so fucked. Can't get away. I just might as well go in, all in on this little fucker, and uh, could go there, and he could go there, and I could two D him. else to do is there try some three pluses Foul, plus two assist, plus three assist if I dodge. Jim foul. Depressing match. <laughs> no, it doesn't matter. That's just what I've got to keep repeating to myself. Um, two stuns in a KO. It could have been much worse, yeah. It could have been much worse. Probably need two removals to be able to stabilize. <laughs> That's what I think. Two more removals, and maybe I can stabilize. I mean, at least he hasn't got pressure on the ball, but then I'm much more concerned about my players getting killed than pressure on the ball. Yeah, I want, uh, it was bad that he was going to get the pom, wasn't he? But then he's just he's just a badass anyway, isn't he? Yeah, strength five throw is amazing. Apparently there is. Look, he's gone. He's, he's thinking about going for it. Like, it's still going bad just because I'm getting hit by strength 4, whereas if I'd... Like, it's it's not just the blitz turn, it's it's every turn I'm just standing up in tackle zones. Like, it's, it's bollocks, isn't it? It's going to take quite a lot to get back on equal footing. Quite a lot. These guys just standing up to get knocked over every turn. This guy just getting knocked over, this guy getting knocked over. It's, it's crap, isn't it? It's completely, completely killed the drive. Maybe I could blitz him. Oh my god, my one guard is tied up. Could palm him. Could 
dodge the guard into there, stand him up and pom the... <laughs> it's stupid that I need so many... Oh no, he could, he could just claw him. That would maybe get me out of this pickle. Because this is a horrible situation, these guys just getting banged on. Gotta get my garden to play. With a double skull. Oh, with a quad skull. Oh, good. Yeah, that's how you get your garden to play, yeah. yeah good. Good. I'll tell you what, I'm glad it's in. <laughs> I'm glad it's in Rebel. <laughs> What a stupid fucking match. Should have it was my fault for not predicting a loss for myself. Because I thought I was gonna lose, but I thought, you know, if I win the toss and cause some damage. Like predicting a draw, I didn't think it was really gonna be a draw. I thought either I'd hammer him or he'd hammered me. So I should have known it would he'd be the one hammering me, shouldn't I? Should have fucking known that. <laughs> Defenseless guy getting pommed, brilliant. Yeah, MGR, scrub. If you want to be part of Team Positive, then uh, you've got to fucking suck it up. Stop bitching like a little baby and try and fucking play better. Eh? I'm no players down. I'm actually, I'm, you know, I'm, I'm one player up. No, even, even players. Even players because of the send-off. I'm just in a horrible spot because... My guard's stunned and isolated, even if he wasn't stunned. And this guy's stunned. It's just fucking quad skull. Paint the ball red so it moves too fast for the orcs to pick it up. <laughs> Thanks, Shredder. Um, yeah, I put it back down at 25 bits, by the way. Um, and he's just getting to knock all my guys down every turn because of the blitz. So it's... Although I'm not men down, I'm in a completely, completely horrific position. It doesn't really mean, it doesn't really matter that I'm not men down yet. Because it is just yet. All my guys are in tackle zones. Except for two. None of them can make blocks. It's just horrible. It's absolutely horrible. Jim, are you the hammer or the nail in this game? In this game so far, I'm definitely the nail. But... You're telling me there's a chance he could blitz? Move around four, five, six. He can stay there, he can move there, he can stand up, he can pong, he can dodge. All right. Oh, yeah, I need to dodge to. I need to dodge to hit. Oh, fuck. All right. Yeah, get the push, that's all we need. All right. The 
put him there and him there, then there's a screen, isn't there? Just GSI. No, good. Two assists for a fucking Chaos Warrior to punch a fucking orc thrower. Are you shitting me? And fucking push him. At least the dodge roll was good. When are we going to see some death zones? Sometime. It's not much of a screen, no, but it's better than nothing, isn't it? It's a, it's enough. It's enough of a screen. Four plus dodge to, to get through. It's enough. It's better than it's better than nothing. <laughs> like it'd obviously be a lot better if he was one square one square more, but I want to make two GFA. He's probably just going to get fucking pommed anyway. Really, Lord Arcade. Okay. <laughs> I don't. Can I? Can I get refunds on gifted things? Is that? Is that possible? Can I? Can I get a refund to the person who gifted me something? Because that's something I'd really like to do with something. <laughs> I've already given up on scoring. There's no chance of that. It's just trying to keep my players alive. That's all there is now. <laughs> For all my dodge guys, Jimmy and Pedro. <laughs> I feel bad. I feel bad that Tony's got me so many games that I'm incapable of completing the tutorial in. <laughs> I'm grateful. I'm just inept. <laughs> it's Jimmy the inept. It's 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 Jimmy not even good enough to complete the tutorial to play poorly. Is is what it is. Double one there would have been nice. Hello, Advac. <laughs> You'll have to change his name because there's too many. <laughs> oh, well, I've got I've got the passing option now. Anyway, he's completely abandoned uh, those guys, so I might not lose the game. Hey. Stupid orc thrower nearly lost the game for his team. He lost two out of three. Right now, I've lost. Now I've lost the. Now I've lost the game completely. Um, the only thing to play for is my players not dying. And, and or stupid shit.
double one. I don't want it to. Alright, so just lie down, wait for the half to end, is the play now. Oh well. That's good, isn't it? Maybe I should have done this one dice block first. I mean, it's fair enough, isn't it? You know, it's what it's what I intend to do to people. So it's fair enough. Yeah, but the rear would have been a two, and I would have got him down. Oh no, I'd have got myself down. This is my non-block one, isn't it? No, it's my block, I would have piled him. I'd have one into a two and he would have gone down, I'd have piled on, and I would have been safe. I guess he's gonna foul now. Oh, it was the intercept, that's why I thought I'd double one the pass. Yeah, the intercept was one. Yeah, good. Good, very good point. Yeah, it would have been a it would have been a skull reroll into a skull. <laughs> I guess he'll foul now as well, he might as well, mate. I like scattering the ball there because he might have might have just landed on one of his balls. Save himself for the pickup roll. <laughs> right, this guy being safe is good, isn't it? Guard can't do anything. I can't do anything. I guess it's a corp on the troll. But is it worth it? No. <laughs> the overall break foul is not fun, is it? No, that that, that plan has failed in the first hurdle. Misclick pass would be good. Auto break foul on flat fart, not good. skills only. I wonder it looked so cluttered. One in one in seventy two to die. Maybe it's a little bit more because minus strength. Oh there you go, he died, yeah, of course he did. Like that's so fucking stupid, isn't it? It's one in six to Kazim. Then 1 in 6 to fucking kill him. Of course it happened. Of course it was a 1 in 36. How could it be anything other than 1 in 36 chance? For fuck's sake.
Well, it wasn't even. I'd say one in seventy-two. It wasn't was it? Because thirty-six times six wasn't really. What is it? It's a one in six, then a one in three for a perm, and I would keep a minus agility, and I would keep probably now nah, probably I'll probably keep minus movement. So let's say the kill him is one in thirty-six, and then for the app to fail is one in six. So it's a one in two hundred and eighteen chance, and it nearly fucking happened. Nah, it's not as I'm going to. It's just how much damage I take. Oh, another cow's good. No, oh, dead. Dead beast man, good. Yeah, he rolls he rolls quad six as well, I roll quad ones. It's only the first arm. It's the decision I made with my team at the end of the day. It is what it is, isn't it? I should have just gone Dark Elves to beat all the bad players. <laughs> Farm SPPs and have a, have a team that can win, I guess, is what I should have done. But instead, I went with the kind of the kind of team that I enjoy playing, and uh, yeah, yeah. I guess it is it is a dice thing, no matter how I built my team. That's true. fucking hate it even though even though it's not the top yeah even without the dicing that's true at this kind of tv orcs are still there's no way i mean this is the best chance of beating orcs was my build i think was the best chance of beating orcs just hope to get lucky with clawpon because if you don't have that if i just had some guard guys i would have been fucked yeah i had a chance If I hadn't been blitzed, <laughs> if I'd got to make four two dice blocks instead of none, and then he would have had to base me, and then I would have got to block him instead of me just having to stand up to get blocked more all the time. If my foul hadn't been a gym foul, if my foul had been his flat fart foul, you know, then uh, things would have been a lot different, wouldn't they? Yeah, that's true, Rogue Shenanigans, yeah. Yeah, there's nothing. Nothing, nothing. Anybody I don't think could have done this. <laughs> oh, fingers crossed, Hellboy. Fingers crossed. It's really hard run, though. I mean, everyone's got a hard run when you think about it, but... um. But I'm really not happy about who I think I'll be playing in the in the in any round really. <laughs> I don't think I've got a favourable like a really favourable matchup like some people got. Um yes, Rogue Shanians, there's a few games live that I'll be casting. I should be uh, hopefully I'll get two full games casted live. And then um And then I should do some replays after this game as well. Can't believe I've predicted a draw. That was an idiotic prediction. One of us is going to get fucked. I might just use the screen, the screens from that prediction, and then do a do a retake. Oh my god! Super mighty Parmesan. Oh my god! This is the one. 
My mate has tagged me and said this is the one. And it is. Holy shit. The Kilimanjaro Super Mighty Parmesan. One, two, three, four, five Parmos on one plate. Yeah. I mean, I'm gonna put it on Imgur for you. Holy moly. Pretty bad, Raz, pretty bad. Uh, we've got a dead beast man. Well, minus AV, I mean, he's keepable. But he's dead in terms of development. Um, just missed next game, flat fart, thanks to the apple. Just badly hurt, warrior, and sent off for the one foul that I made. Wow, he gave me the ball. He fuck Imagine if this had bounced there, he would have just given me the fucking ball. For fuck's sake. I could, have done. I could have just dodged away and then and then like passed it and then I might have got a stalled out a one nil loss. <laughs> yeah, no, it wouldn't have mattered. You're right. You're right. You're right. It wouldn't have mattered. I could have stalled out a one nil loss. <laughs> Now the score is uh, zero three. Hello, Emperor Augustus. And this is probably a zero SPP game for me, and a dead beast man. Not the. Not the most enjoyable game that I've had, but then the whole point of my team is to give unenjoyable games to my opponent, isn't it? So, you know, there's there's no point crying about it, is there? <laughs> the one on the winnings, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's true, DJ, that's probably, that's probably what it's going to be. <laughs> I'm j I just regret predicting a draw because a draw was stupid because it was always going to be like this or the other way, you know? Like if it hadn't been a blitz and I'd made four cas on turn one, mm -hmm. I'd have steamrolled. One of us was going to steamroll the other. So predicting a draw was just fucking stupid. That's the. Uh, but then but then me and Raz drew, didn't we? Because we were both like pussyfooting around, um, not really doing a whole lot. And I guess this could have gone like that.
<laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, exactly. That, yeah. But I mean, he's zero too, so he's probably got no chance of the playoffs. So a, a draw could have happened, I guess, if if I hadn't been blitzed on, and if I'd made a few removals. But not nothing, you know, nothing game breaking. I could have made a few removals, and then he could have we could have traded blitzers, and then I could have scored, and then if I hadn't made a lot of cars, he could have, you know, I wouldn't have fought him, and then I guess I guess we could have had a one-one draw the same as we did. So yeah. I guess the draw wasn't such a bad prediction. Not even one in six, thirty percent. Thirty percent of the time I make sweep I make that sweep pass, yeah. It wasn't bad, was it? One in six with a reroll was like thirty percent. It could have well happened. It could have well happened that I'd made that fucking pass, to be fair. One, two, three, four, five. Hmm. Oh yeah, pass catching. So there you go, one in five. One in five times I would have still drawn the game. So that's not bad, is it? As ridiculous as it went. I blitzed and got triple, triple pushes. <laughs> yeah, that's true, I don't like us, yeah. Dodges? Uh, what do you mean for him? For me? Can you use them for dodges and, and GFIs? I want one reroll for the turn 16 so I can run up for my LOS punches. Um, this dodge here, for example, is a good one to use it on, isn't it?
I'm not going to re-roll it though. <laughs> Uh, you mean the Rebel Recap? I don't know, DJ Raz, it's tough. It's actually really tough at the moment to do the Rebel Recap. So, it's going to depend on how early in the morning I wake up and stuff. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm snowed under with the World Cup. It's really hard because when I'm streaming, I can't upload. If I could upload at the same time as I was streaming, it would be brilliant. But, because I can't, you know, I went... It's just, it, I just don't have enough time in the day to upload all the videos that I've made of the World Cup, so I'm going to have to get up at like 6am and stuff and start uploading then, and uh, once I get on top of the uploading the World Cup, then I can do the uh, the Rebel Recap. Uh, I did it on, well, I did it on Monday, um, you can, but then it's shit. <laughs> and it's shit. I don't know if you watched the recap, but I had loads of cuts and everything and you know you just you can't just it's not the same as just putting a video on it's proper garbage when you just put them straight on from twitch With him, have now like a Zeke Blitz safer. Hey, fuck you, shithead off. Fucking biscuit. Get fucked, you little cunt! <laughs> Fuck off! Can only upload one at a time, try. So that's all I've been able to do anyway. Maybe you can clear them up. But then I've got to leave the computer on all night, haven't I? Which is a bit shit. Right, maybe a Kaz for Guy de Caron. Maybe a Kaz for Brainless Chaos. Maybe a cast for the Christmas man. And a completion for Halosaurus. And then it's not so bad. Good for you. <laughs> I guess I won't block on him the most, more than block on him, but then it's harder for him to get cards. So give him the three dice. Oh no, no, Mighty Blow, Mighty Blow wants him, doesn't he? Mighty Blow wants him. 100% Mighty Blow wants him. Um, he can go four, five, six, seven. And he can get five, he can go, yeah, okay, something like this. You can do it. Got the pow. This isn't a three dice, is it? I'm gonna have to blitz for a three.
Of course it was a one. <laughs> oh, fucking hell. <laughs> well, Flat Fart didn't die. That's good. And MVP Warrior is good as well. So, you know, some good things happened. Um, got, you know, got some star player points. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. It's been two dicing so far for my Chaos team. One was, was in my favour and I still lost. <laughs> <laughs> and then one was not in my favour and I got hammered. And then I still got out bashed against Raz. It wasn't it wasn't horrific dicing, but I still got out, out bashed when the mirror. <laughs> Slightly though it was it was the leap, it was the fucking Chaos Warrior leap that is why uh, why it was a draw really, wasn't it? I might have been able to stop it if it wasn't for that. Um so yeah, the warrior can go for a completion and level up, that'll be good. Um 11 men for the next match, so I could buy two more beast men to go to 13 maybe, depending on what happens. But, um, yeah, exactly, Sean. Yeah, that's, that's the stupidest thing. <laughs> you know, like, I'm gutted to have lost. It's, it's just horrible. It's horrible. I hate losing. I hate it. But, yeah, obviously it's better to be in Division 7, isn't it? So... Fire the year V7 depends who I'm playing and stuff, but um, long term, of course, he's a he's a crap, he's a crap player that you don't want on your team really. But on the other hand, he, a block mighty blow armor seven is is better than a rookie, isn't he? He's just literally better than a rookie. So see what happens. Just depends who I'm playing and stuff. Not necessarily, not necessarily sack him. But the fact that I want to have you know 13 players for the next match means that if no one dies, I probably won't want 15, so then I probably will sack him rather than sacking a rookie that could develop better and not have armor seven. But um, yeah, there you go. Congrats to uh, Puppy anyway. Played, played, played well enough to win. I'm sure somebody could have found a way to lose that game somehow. And what a match that was. Uh, what a thrilling strategical battle there. Um, very, very enjoyable for both of us, absolutely. Um, so let's have a look at what other matches happened uh, on match day three. So yeah, I'm just going to have a quick look at the other results. Um, as you can see, Crematorium Crew were on the bye week. Um, they got a win and a Mummy MVP, which is good. Yep, so this is the uh, my match, 2-0 loss. N not even a game, despite nearly getting as many armor breaks, surprisingly. And not being able to do anything for the entire match. MVP on the Curse Warrior is good. Um, yeah, 16 blocks. <laughs> um, yeah, well, there you go. That was it. It wasn't really. Didn't look like anything to me. Block dice. <laughs> 18 pushes, 8 pals, 12 things. Mm. Yeah, it was pre pretty, pretty awful non-event for me. So Holy Boy managed to get the win over Ramhard here, two 0 despite getting pretty outbashed on AV breaks at least. Uh, not many cars though. So maybe that was the deciding factor, eh? Um, yeah, you know, I can't go to death for this without looking at the match. There's really nothing to say, is there? Uh, I, all I can do is apologise. Muppetillo enjoying his uh, good start here. Car continuing his good start versus Keji Ruse. Uh, twice as many AV breaks, more blocks, more cars, more KOs. Um, could we look at the block dice for each game? 25, 22, 31 versus 32, 34, 32, 35. So pretty much, you know, pretty, uh, pretty, you know, they usually, they usually even out. Um, you know, what can you say? Oh, bad GFIs, you know? Like the block dice ratio is the thing that usually evens out. Everything else um, doesn't really have enough of a sample size to average out does it so and even then you can't tell because somebody couldn't you know roll loads of two plus dodges but then one crucial double one could lose them the game but 
well done to Muppetillo anyway. So Wayne Farrer drawing with Rasta. If it was anything like my game, it was probably just a cagey 1-1 draw where both teams were kind of happy to not get clawed much. Not a bunch of, not a whole bunch of blocks. Quite a lot of KOs and cars. Um, so yeah, they were, it was probably a little bit like like the match that I had versus Rasta. 28, 22, 26. And 22, 25, 19. So a touch unlucky there with the POWs. But there you go. And an absolute shocker here is Hindi is taken down by Skulls. And that's not an insult to Skulls' coaching ability. Um, just on sheer teams, this Lizard team was immense. Um, Holy Boys Lizards were ravaged in the first game. But um, I really expected this Lizard team to do very well. Um, he did make three cars and three KOs. I, I believe he did some permanent damage as well to the Lizards. So I guess, you know, some people will be happy about that. <laughs> and uh, yeah, let's have a look at the block dice. 36, 33, 35. And... 38, 32, 36. So pretty, pretty average block dice for both teams. Um, but you know, getting out blocked by dwarves and them making some cars. Uh, you know, that's it again. I, I don't know what the actual cars were. With not covering it live, but um, I do believe Hindi lost a few guys in this one. Um, so yeah, well done, to, well done to Skulls for uh, managing to pull that one out of the bag. And it's three wins out of three for the coach, beating Grendrake. I mean, as you would expect, really. Um, Woody's beating Lizards. Even outbashed them. I mean, it's it's not always one-sided because, the you know, the Lizards can just beat up the Woodies. But when the Woodies beat up the... Wow, four KOs and three cards from seven armor breaks. That is that is pretty ridiculous when each AV break is a removal. Um, so, you know, maybe it was a dicing. 23, 18, 19 versus 21, 33, 27. Um, but yeah, you know, congrats to him. Three wins out of three. Unfortunately, I'm doing this way after the fact, so there's no, there's no league table for me to look at or anything. Um, so yeah, you know, again, I can only apologise. That will be back in week five, uh, which shouldn't be too long now, because uh, I'm getting caught up and the World Cup... The World Cup has calmed down a lot now. There were so many games in the first few weeks of the World Cup, it was really hard to keep up. But now I'm on top of that, so I'll get on top of the Rebel too. Right, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.